why do you need a general purpose blade for your table saw? Well, for me, it's a blade that I don't have to change in and out all the time when I'm going between jobs. It's a blade that does most jobs pretty well, and so that means that unless I've got something really specialised that I'm doing, it can stay in the machine. On the general spectrum of how a table saw blade performs, you've either at one end got a blade that's really fast and can rip through timber at great speeds, or you've got a blade that is, uh, gives you a really smooth finish on your cut. And as those two features come together, the general purpose blade sits somewhere in the middle. So, you know, it's a, probably the, the first blade that you'll get for your table saw. It's going to do most jobs pretty well. You're not going to get a ton of tear out on cross cuts, and you're going to be able to do pretty reasonable rip cuts. But, you know, if you're going to be ripping a ton of long hardwood that's really thick, get a ripping blade. And if you're going to do a ton of really, really fine joinery with a ton of cross cuts, we'll look at a cross cut blade for that instead. Let's have a look at how it performs through some timber and I'll show you some of those cuts. If you're looking for a more in-depth look at uh, how to get the most out of your saw blades, check out this video that we made last year. It's a bit longer, much more detail, and you'll get some uh, other great information there.